Thanks for finding time to watch this video. I want to share how Werby helped me to make my warehouse work better and my job easier and simpler. All of us tried to create a warehouse layout in Excel. We analyzed KPIs, sorted items by ABC, and used a lot of personal experience trying to optimize our warehouses. Yet, my results were not as good as I hoped. I have recently started to use Werby in my warehouse, and it was very easy to start and simple to use. Very quickly, I have managed to improve picking productivity, saving direct costs without investing any money at all. Let me show you how I use it. Let me log in first. To save us the time, I have uploaded the relevant data into Werby in advance. You just need warehouse locations, current stock, historical orders, and items. You would be able to do it yourself, simply exporting the data from your WMS or ERP system to a CSV format. I will show you how in another video. I have also done the analysis run so we can quickly see the results. To improve something, you have to measure it accurately first. Werby analyzes your operational historical data and calculates the most important KPIs like cost, picking time, distance traveled and CO2 footprint. To understand better your cost drivers, the analysis is split between individual task categories like traveling, picking at the location, lifting, and additional handling. You can switch between cost and time. You can also configure your pallet stacking rules and priorities to analyze potential pallet reordering that will take place during the picking, so your fragile items will not be crushed. Replenishment analytics are calculated automatically as well. Examine how much replenishment contributes to the overall operational costs. Let us look at my warehouse layout now. An interactive map of my warehouse is very useful to understand the distribution of fast movers versus slow ones. You can easily focus on one of the three categories, like the position of my items, and see where slow movers are placed. I can choose the bay view as well. It gives a different angle of the stock positions. You can examine individual locations and see their neighbors. Location Info Panel gives information about location properties and items that are assigned to it. Now let us look at the Order Level Analytics. Understanding how pickers move through the warehouse has a lot of important insights. Werby presents top orders by cost, distance, and picking time. I can choose individual order to show the KPIs for it and the actual path that was taken. Each step is detailed showing distance traveled and handling time spent picking. We can also see the congestion of the area. Werby helps me a lot in my daily decision making, and it will help you as well. You can try for free when you register on Werby.com. Werby helps me with the compliance check as well. Let me show you how easy it is. Included in the analytics results is an audit of weight compliance and item dimensions. Starting with weight compliance, we can check bay and individual locations for overweight. The summary on the left-hand side provides easy focus on the non-compliant bays that can be presented as a list or on the interactive map. Choosing the bay will show additional info about it, detailing compliance issues in red if exist. We can also examine individual locations for weight compliance and quickly flag the non-compliant ones. The Location Info panel gives me all the information I need to resolve the weight issues. I can easily check if any of the items do not fit into the location, blocking the location next to it. The interactive map points me quickly to the problem. The dimension that does not fit will be shown in red. Werby is a very handy tool to be compliant and in control. Go to werby.com slash trial to try it for free. Thank you.